Today, I'm gonna to show you the easiest way to find the perfect domain name for your website. This process can save you hours by helping you to come up with hundreds of names in minutes. Plus, I'll show you how to get your domains at the cheapest price, which can save you over $100 per year. We'll do this by using a combination of free domain search tools and of course, AI. I've been refining this process over the 10 years that I've been building websites. The first step is to come up with lots of ideas for your domain name. If you know the exact domain you want, you can skip to the second step. That's where I'll show you how to check every domain variant to see what's available. But this step is the hardest for most people. Luckily getting a massive list of ideas is easier now than ever. To do this, head over to ChatGBT and use the prompt I've left in the description. Once you've put this in, ChatGBT will ask you to describe your business. The more information you give, the better the suggestions will be, but even a basic description works. Here, I'll just put in a community for poodle dog owners. Then you'll get a list of ideas back. Now, you might notice that there's no .com or any other ending to these ideas, and that is intentional. We've requested that in the prompt to make the next step easier. You see here where we ask for 20 second level domain name alternatives. That means we only want the bit before the .com, .co.uk, or any other suffix. We specifically say we don't want the suffixes in this part of the prompt. All domains consist of a top level and a second level domain. First, we've come up with ideas for the second level domain, then we'll search for dozens of top level domains for each idea. And that's how we create hundreds of domain options in minutes. So now that you've got a list of ideas, let me show you how to create and search all of these domains at once. Now, the old fashioned way would be to search each of these one by one on a domain registrar, which is a website that sells domains, but that is way too slow. Instead, I'll first show you how to search search all of the options for a second level domain at once. Then I'll show you how to search for hundreds of combinations simultaneously. If you know the second level domain you want, or there's only a few options, this first approach will work for you. Go to IWantMyName.com and enter the second level domain. It'll then show you almost every possible combination and which are available. As you can see, there are loads. You don't necessarily need to buy them from here though. This site usually isn't the cheapest. And I'll show you how to find the cheapest registrar and my personal favorites in the next step. So that works well if you've got one or two ideas. But how do we search for all of our generated ideas simultaneously? Well, to do this, you need Namecheap's Beast Mode. This tool lets you search for up to 5,000 ideas at once. So go ahead and copy the list you generated earlier and paste it into Namecheap's Beast Mode. Then select all the top level domains or suffixes that you want. A good starting point is all the top level domains that you see in this popular list. You can go ahead and select them all by clicking here. Then hit generate and let it do the search for you. It'll take a few seconds, but it'll show you every single combination at once. You want to find one that's available and isn't a premium domain. Premium means that someone else has bought this before you and is reselling it now at a higher price. Just ignore these. They're not worth the price or the hassle when you're starting out. Repeat this process of generating ideas and searching options until you find a domain you like. So, where do you actually buy them? Well, my favorite two registrars at the moment are Namecheap and GoDaddy. Both sites are reliable, easy to use, and quite competitive on price. But if you want to find the absolute cheapest place to buy your domain, you can use this tool. Head over to tldlist.com and enter the domain. It'll show you the registrar with the cheapest initial registration, the cheapest renewal, and the best three-year value. Remember that domains are an annual subscription, so keep an eye on the renewal price. Once you've picked a registrar, add the domains you want to cart. Then go to checkout, purchase them like anything else. If you get the option for who is privacy or domain privacy, take it if it's free. This hides your personal details when people search for the domain. Once you finish the purchase, you'll have an account with that registrar and you can access the domains when you log in. And from there, you can connect them to your website, your email address, or anything you want. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you want more videos like this, please let me know what you'd like to learn about in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.